All right, what's up, guys? Uh, episode three of our Minecraft solo server. Um, after uh, yesterday's video, I went mine. Ah, uh, well, I went to bed actually, like in real life. Then I woke up, and then I went mining. And I'll show you what I found. So I also added I uh, added a lot to the house. So I went mining. I got first of all 20 obsidian so we can go to the nether and make an enchanting table. YouTube. Okay. Anyways. So we can make an enchanting table. And uh, we can make a portal to the nether. And I also was mining, okay? And I found one, two, three, fourteen diamonds. And I also got one card, a trident. I, a first round I killed from the entire server, I got a trident like two minutes ago. I just started recording because of that. And then I'm smelting up some iron, and then we have some gold smelted up in here. And then I'm, I'm in the middle of working on our house. A creeper uh, creeped up on me when I was sleeping. I wake up and there's a hole in my floor. I also got myself some iron armor. And a tip. I didn't do it there because I'm too lazy to make slabs. But it's a lot cheaper to put your floor as slabs. Like if you look under here. All of our floor is just slabs besides those like four blocks. Oh, no, I'm not wasting wood on that. Befi besides there's like four blocks. So that's that's good. And then we have our beautiful purple carpets with the bed and all that. But I think this floor is almost done. We have a chest room. I think I'm going to extend it up one more story on this floor. And then I think we're going to be done. And then we can make a second floor that has our enchanting table and anvil and all that great stuff. I just realized this is a oak log. And I just made them all into... Actually, no, I didn't. Okay, yeah, I can fix that. All right. So I'm going to go over all the windows and make them all wood. Normally I don't build on camera because it's kind of boring, but I did make an entire episode dedicated to mining, so I don't know. I'm going to build for now. Oh my god, this is so glitchy. Alright. Um, yeah. We've done a lot. The servers come together. Ho my hopes are, I haven't died yet. Hopes are we can fight the Ender Dragon without dying. That'd be like the best, but I doubt we're going to be able to. All right, let me go grab some more wood. I need some more. And then that's our mine down there. I'm not gonna cave anymore, but there was a cave down there that I found some diamonds in. It's getting nighttime, but I'm gonna get some wood anyways because I need it. Oh yeah, sugarcane. I was searching for this stuff. I took it took like an hour to find some, and then I forgot to pick it up. So I'm happy that there's some here. We're gonna have to start a major sugarcane farm to get enough paper for um, what's it called? Paper for the uh, enchanting table, all the books. I also have to start a food farm, like a farm, and then a cow pen probably. Cow pen be the best. But I need food badly. Like I have no food. And I never have food. Which kinda sucks because you know food's pretty essential in Minecraft. You you don't get food, you starve to death. By far the worst way to die in Minecraft is either falling into lava. Yeah, they're both the exact same. Dying in lava is the worst. Falling next to lava and having some of your stuff burn is the second worst. And then dying because of a glitch or suffocating in gravel is the third worst. 
It's just, I hate it. But the gravel one, you can kind of get your stuff back if you know where to get suffocated. But if you don't, there goes your stuff. It's a weird little cave. Hope we can make it back to our Oh no. I need to get a bow soon. Honestly, I'm probably gonna fish after I get this enchanting table all set up. I'm gonna fish for a while, hopefully get some good books. You can't AFK fish anymore, which is very annoying, but you know. No. Do I have any food anywhere? I really hope I do. I did get nine books when I raided that village, and I think there's some more books there that I can go check for. I think there was a hay bale there. I think we'll do that after I finish up the first story of the base. All right, we got 30 logs. That should be enough. Anyway, I'm, I did it. I'm probably not going to film when I get diamonds because it's not letting me combine the clip my the clips together so i'm just gonna mine them unless i find like i might just keep them there once i have a fortune or a silk touch i'll just mine them with that and then mine them on camera i think that'll be better how should we hmm, should we yeah no is this too low of a roof or do you think we should go up another level is that bad? That's not too bad. I'm kind of tempted to make it slabs because then we can put an extra chest there. I'm going to make it slabs because that's just more chests. We only have, that'll make 9, 12. That's good. And if we ever want to add like a chandelier, which, oh, I have a, uh, it could work. We could have like, Nah, it won't work, but we could add a sh uh, like mini chandelier if we really want to. I say we do slab roof, because I'm pretty sure you can put a chest here and it will open, because there's space. At least that's how I think it should work. Uh, this video is not going to be as long as the other one, because all I'm going to do... It's probably make my house bigger and go to that village and check if they have any food. I might fill in the roof off. Yeah, actually, never mind. But I'll just use the slabs that I have and then we can go check the village. Now, if I knew how to make pumpkin pie, I'd be set because there's pumpkins everywhere. But I'm dumb, and I don't know how to make pumpkin pie. And those torches are too low. They need to be on four. Because it looks nicer. Well, that one's just going to have to stay there. This is going up. This is going up. That's going up. That's going up. That's going up. Those are staying, that's going up, that's going up, and I think that's it. Of course, we got to do the inside too, but we'll do that later. Uh, all right, there's some rotten flesh, which sadly is all the food I'm going to be getting my hands on for a while. Hope I don't get hunger, and of course I got hunger. I'm not gonna kill any animals because I'm, like I'm gonna make animal pens next time. Like after, uh, off camera, I'm gonna make some animal pens. The village is over here. Make some animal pens so I don't starve to death all the time. I haven't died because of starvation yet. Where the, where is the village at? I haven't died of starvation yet, surprisingly. Oh, it's all the way over here. Okay. It does look they have like they have some wheat, and I am gonna kill you because I know I'm not coming this far for cows. Okay, good. They have a farmer here, and I haven't traded with them so I can make them something 
that is a lot better than a farmer. He can be a librarian once I capture him. But he can stay for a farmer right now. Of course I looted this place. Oh, good, there's two farmers. So I can have two librarians. Nice. And there's a librarian. What's he sawing? Silk touch, not bad. And I'll make sure to, you know. Oh yes, books galore, we're taking all this. We got 18 books. Pretty good. Oh, I didn't. I didn't even see this part of the town. And we have sweet berries for food now. Oh, we have a clerk. I'm gonna probably keep him for pearls. Um, potatoes over there. I can make some baked potatoes. I'll grab the potatoes. And I'm not giving any back. Actually, I'll, I'll keep one so I don't have no potatoes. So if I ever come back here, they can give me more potatoes. You know, that's how life works. You get one potato and I take all. I'll grab the pumpkin if I can find my axe. Alright. I think... That's all the houses, unless there's one on top of the hill. Look at those parkour skills. Uh, it doesn't look like there's one up here, but there is a cow to murder. Yeah, so we'll probably, I'm probably gonna get one of the villagers in a boat and bring them to a little, I don't know, villager trading hall area next to my house. Yeah, might even put them, nah, the, there wouldn't be enough space. I was thinking about putting them inside my house, but there would not be enough space for it. I could put maybe one or two in there, but then it'd get cramped. Oh. Alright, so we got some books. And that's it. Also got some food. Oh, beetroots. I saw some wheat around here that I want. I don't think it's here anymore. Mm -mm. It's weird. And the cat over there. Oh, that is a not a cat. That's a horse. Uh, yeah. So, we'll come take some villagers from this place later. But for now, I think I'm gonna head home. Um, getting them home actually might not be that big of an issue. We'll just have to get them uh, over to this ledge here. And we could make the boat go all the way over here. And we won't have to build up, like, almost at all. Which is great. That's actually really good. We could go down here. And then we might have to build a little bit over here. To the other side of this. And we can... I'll just do it now. Like that. And we can pull them all the way over here. And so that's where I want them. Yeah, that's good, that's good plans. I am gonna make the enchanting table on camera, but, and the nether portal, but I'm not going in, I might go in the nether, I don't know. I don't know yet. But I hate the nether. And how many bookshelves? Oh, I can make five, that's actually not a bad start. All right, so, we'll just put this in our chest for now. Um, I think I have some flint. Yeah, I have a little bit of flint. And we need some steel. AKA iron. I can make some chests, but no, we're making iron. 
I don't know where I'm, I'm gonna put it outside for now, but I'm gonna move it maybe inside. Maybe I'll just make it its own little house, but for now it's gonna be out here. I know you don't need to use the four corner blocks, but it just looks more complete if you do. I think that's how you make another portal. All right, let's see. Come on, another fortress spawn. Please don't give me a bad one. Awful. This is not good. I hear gassed. Magma cube. Oh, there's a guest. There's more than one. Uh oh. Oh, no, I'm out of here, fam. I don't have a bow to kill it. Should have killed it. Yeah. All right. Good. Of course, there's another one over there. Need to eat. All right. Fight me, bud. Uh oh. This isn't good. Not. Nope, I have to leave. Uh, yep, I'm out of here. I want to get rid of him though. I need to heal. I need to heal before I do anything about him. Alright, come on, fight me. Fight me, buddy. Shoot a fireball. Shoot it. We're just gonna make that noise and not do anything? Guess so. Oh, his face is messed up. Oh my god, that noise is scary. What the frick? There's more gas here. All right, we gotta go. We gotta go. I just want to check if there's another fortress anywhere near us. Uh, not seen. Not seen. Come on, chunks. Load in. Not seen one, but the chunks are loading, and I'm out of here. I'll look at the truck over here really quick. Doesn't look like it. That sucks. I'm gonna grab a little bit of soul sand in case we wanna make a water elevator. Oh, let's go, there's one right there. Okay, we know that, so let's make a torch trail. That is so good, it's so good. It's not even that far. Torch trail. And then, here we go. All right, let's go. Let's get out of this very evil place. All right. Building terrain, I think it's glitched. Um. I hear stuff, but I don't see stuff. I guess this is the end of the video. I'm not going to be able to see it, but see you guys. It was a pretty good, pretty eventful video. Went to the nether for the first time. Might grind some uh, nether blaze and stuff and stuff like that. But I'm definitely going to get a villager before next episode. So uh, thanks for watching. Uh, 